No. No, we're not doing this right now. No, dude, we've we've been over this. It's it's nothing against you. You're adorable. I I love collecting you guys. It's just I'm I'm working on this right now. I've got to focus on the HO scale layout. You know, the other projects. Like I can't just no, I I can't just be a capsule play rail collector. Like I'm working you you see this. I'm currently I'm making a heritage line. Like I can't stop. No, dude. Allahu Akbar. All right, guys, we are back for we are back for another capsule play rail unboxing, but not just any capsule play rail package. This all comes from the homie Westy, and there should be some really cool surprises in here. So shout out to him. If you're on Twitter and not following Westy, like, what are you doing? Come on. Honestly, forget the intro. Let's just let's just get in here. Let's just see what's inside of this thing. All right, so everything you're about to see here comes from an auction website. I have no clue what auction website. I just asked Westy, hey, I need these characters, and he was like, bro, say no more, I got you. I sent him the money, and boom. So let's just go ahead and see what we have in here. All right, let's just get these out of the way. I believe these are, yeah, these are just catalogs. All right, let's get to the good stuff. Let's start with this first one here. Oh, thank, okay. We have Capsule Play Rail Edward, finally. He's so much more cute than I thought he'd be, like, in person. He, just like James, is scrunched up. He doesn't have a separate tinder, he just has it, you know, molded to his back. But thank gosh, guys, we finally have an Edward to complete the collection. And not just Edward, we have Teasel Tin as well. As you can see here, he has a pinchy that opens and closes. So we have Teasel Tin and Edward to start off the unboxing. And let's just take a closer look at Diesel Tin. Wow. I had one of these, like, a long time ago. I want to say when they were in the United States and came in those, like, transparent Easter eggs. But that was so long ago, God knows what happened to him. I've never had an Edward, I know that for sure. So now we have these two, an amazing start to this unboxing. So All right, let's just see what's next. I really don't remember what all, like, I've got. So let's just see what all's in here. What is this? Oh, we have Molly. We have Molly. Abby specially requested that I get Molly, so this one is a huge bet. We also have her Tinder. Gosh, there's so much detail on these things. Like, it always mesmerizes me and amazes me how much of the character they're able to fit into such a tiny little train. Here's a better look at the face. This is a... This is a wonderful model. This has to be probably one of my favorites now too. Just like all the ones I'm going to literally unbox. All right, this is this is one of the big ones for me. We have Boko, Capsule Play Rail freaking boko this was one of the ones that i knew i had to get but was like how on earth am i going to get a boko like at all and all thanks to westy i now finally have one this is like this is like a coming of age moment like i feel so accomplished and as you can see here all of the detail is molded he's a capsule what did you expect but he looks amazing i love his face as well so we have poco to add to this collection as well Let's see here. Next up, we have Stepney V Blue Bell Engine. This one unfortunately doesn't have side rods, but I am not complaining. He looks amazing. And just like I said with these guys, the amount of detail they're able to get in such a small model is amazing. I love this little dude. It does kind of stink that he doesn't have side rods, but like I, I can't really complain there. The fact that I have a Stepney is amazing. <laughs> We don't just have Stephanie in this little lot. We also have, that's right. Douglas now has his proper Tinder. This one was just a gift from Westy. He just decided to send me this to help me with this little issue that I had. So now all I need to get is a, uh, 
Donald engine for his tinder and I'll have the Scottish twins. But we at least have a complete Douglas now. What is this we have here? Oh, we have a surprised Percy. This one doesn't have a wind-up feature, but hey, no complaints. I need more Percys. And this little dude is adorable. I love this little guy. So my Capsule Play Rail Percy collection is now expanding as well. Here's a better look at his face. Alrighty, that's all from that little bit of packaging. I believe there's more in here though, let's see. There is, let's, oh, we have a sticker pack. And this here should be, oh, yes it is, the Airplane James. When I saw that they released this guy, I had to get him. I knew I had to have an Airplane James in my life. Like, just look at this guy, look at him tell me you don't want to buy this guy. I'm pretty sure he was also the most expensive, like, out of this entire lot, but, like, it was worth it. Can you guess what I'm about to say about him? This one might be one of my favorites. He has the CGI face, but, again, there is no complaints here. This is a wonderful little model. Doesn't have a wind-up feature. It is a pull-along, but it will be a happy inclusion in my railway, so let's go ahead and get the stickers on this guy. Alrighty, everybody. So we have the James now completed with all of his stickers on him. This is what he looks like when he is all completed. And yep, just like I said, this is probably one of my favorite capsule play rails now. I was gonna buy this guy on eBay, but he was like 60 bucks and I'm sorry, I can't buy, no matter what the capsule is, I just can't buy it for $60 in a good conscience and feel good about myself. So I'm happy to have gotten him for the, I think it was 10 or 15 that I did. Basically brand new where I could put the stickers on him myself and oops, you know, make sure he was gonna be all right. So. Definitely worth every penny for this guy. And just as a quick recap of everything we got, we have Airplane James, Molly with her Tinder, Finally, a proper tender for Douglas. A standard Edward model, which is exactly what I needed. This is perfect. A Stepney, which is definitely unexpected, but so welcome. I am so happy to have one of these guys. Diesel Tin with his pinchy that opens and closes, so definitely a welcome addition as well. A surprised Percy, which is always welcome. I'm always happy to have more of these guys in my collection. And probably the creme de la creme for me, the capsule play rail. Boko. This is probably one of my favorite lots that I've gotten so far. And again, huge shout out to the homie, the little Western for helping me get everything that you see here. None of this would have been possible without him. I totally just realized that Molly is backwards. Her, uh, this is her back sticker and this is her, um, I guess tender front sticker, but they are, or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, but, uh, Something tells me these are supposed to be switched. I couldn't tell you. You know, maybe Molly's my favorite. I don't know. These guys are all dope. I love literally every single one of these. Now you guys see the problem. It's his fault. It's this guy's fault. He started this. If it weren't for him, this wouldn't have happened. Shit's like crack, I'm telling you. Uh -huh. 